Nobody wants to work with somebody who is second guessing themselves. I don't know if a lot of people know this about you. You had a professional hmm. baseball career, was that it? Well, I well, a semi-pro. I was actually scouted by, I was getting scouted by the Minnesota Twins and the Oakland A's at one point in time wow. in high school. And then I uh, tore my rotator cuff, so that sort of uh, cut that dream a little bit. And unfortunately, my shoulder never returned to what it was. Mm -hmm. So that was a short-lived dream. But uh, I had moments, sparks of that. What helped you believe in yourself? You know, in our in our, in our industry, whatever we, you know, this this entertainment industry, it's it, what it does teach a lot or for a lot of people. And I had this conversation with people that are not into it. Is that we have to have a lot of belief in ourselves. Mm. We have to have a lot of confidence in ourselves. Even when we don't feel it, we've got to get, we've got to have it because nobody wants to work with somebody who is second guessing themselves, yeah. who is not positive, who is you know negative and just you know low energy. They don't want to work with that. They want to mm. work with someone who it walks on you know walks onto set or walks into a room and is like, let's do this. We can do this. Mm. And if a mistake happens, screw it. Let's get back into it. We've got this. You know, yep, yep. that's who people want to work with. Yeah. I think my favorite thing about technology is that it frees up your time to be creative, to be introspective, yep. right? It's supposed to take mm. away the mundane things. But at the same time, too, one can argue that it makes us a little bit dumber because I don't yeah. know about yes. you, but <laughs> I can't spell worth a damn. If you ask me to write something down mm. on a piece of paper, so much. But dude, my spelling is so bad now without spell check, you know, with, with, without something simple like that. It's like, I feel like an idiot We got sometimes. the t-shirt. Yeah. We should make the t-shirt. Our yeah. spelling is thanks to tech. Uh, yeah. <laughs> spelling, um, math is probably out the window as well. Yeah. Dude, I can't even write anymore. The other day I was writing on a piece of paper and I'm like, oh my God, my penmanship is terrible. <laughs> I, I'm like, wow, I, I I would be, I would get a failing grade in yeah. third, you know, like right now, if I was in third grade, my teacher would, would yeah, you know, hold me back a year. Yeah, it's so bad because yeah. I'm used to typing everything. Yeah. Meanwhile, yeah. we can send a message like in seconds, like nobody's business, right? And it's gotten so bad to yeah. the point where I actually just typed down my grocery list already. You know, where once upon a time we used to write down what we needed from the grocery store. Now it's just notes. Okay, I need eggs, I, bread. Jackie, that's so that's so 2012. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> it's called Siri. Oh, it's right. Google Assistant. <laughs> Come what? on, Jackie, get with I'm it. I'm so sorry. You guys still go to the supermarket? <laughs> and I just order that <laughs> shit online, get it sent. It's here within a day. Come on, I'm, guys. I'm old one. school like that. I'm old school like that. I like to see, see, touch, touch, feel, feel the products, you know. <laughs> what does the next few months or years look like for Bobby Tonelli? Uh, do you have any goals you want to hit? do more regional work once we can start traveling again. I think that was what I was hoping for for 2020. And I had uh, that sort of a line right. to get out of Singapore a bit more, do more regional work. So I hope to do that coming into it. Um, you know, obviously settle down a little bit more, maybe get married or mm. something like that, you know, because, you know, I mean, it's time, you yeah. know, it's time. Sure. I can't be the Lone Ranger forever, you know? <laughs> uh, I think it just comes to that time where you go, okay, I'm ready to settle down, like, okay. Mm. I mean, I'm not out there and going to nightclubs. I'm not dating anyone. I've been with the same person for a number of years now, I think for like seven years. So it's like, okay, it's time to settle down. Mm -hmm. um, so I'd like to do that. Maybe, you know, look at investing in different things, you know? So yeah, you know what I mean? I mean, still obviously entertainment's fun and I love this industry and I'll still dabble in it, but I think more just kind of, you know, investing and diversing a little bit more. Well, you're you know? all grown up. Check you out, marriage, I've investments. <laughs> Oh my. Well, I mean, I mean, I got to. I mean, I'm like, Jackie, sooner or later, you know? You know I'm so proud of I you, Bobby. I'm so proud of I mean, you. really, what else am I going to do? I'm playing fathers on TV now. You know what I mean? That's where you're at, you know, Bobby. That's where you're at. And the best part of it was, the best part of it was, I was acting with one of them. They said, can you stop acting like the boyfriend? You know? Oh! I'm like, oh. <laughs>